Hey guys, it is time for another readathon. And this is going to be my TBR for the audiobookathon coming up at the end of April. Stick around to see what books I'm going to be reading for this readathon. Hey y'all, it's Jen and welcome back to my channel at First Inklings. Today is a TBR video for one of the readathons going on in the month of April. This is one that I happen to be hosting with a great cast of other co-hosts and I will link all their channels below and their announcement videos as well as my announcement video for this readathon where you can find all the details you need to find. Um, I am going to recap some stuff so stick around. First of all, this is Audiobookathon, so we are all about the audiobook for this one. You can combine this with any other readathon going on at the same time. I am sure that you are able to find audiobooks that will fit all of our challenges plus the other readathons as well. But let's just dive into this. So our this readathon takes place April 15th through the 28th. And uh, the first prompt is to just to listen to your audiobook for 30 minutes a day. We don't care when you do that. It could be in the car on the way to work or on the way home from work or running errands while you're at the gym, which is where I plan on listening to my 30 minutes. Just however you can fit in 30 minutes a day for 14 days. That is your first challenge. The second challenge is to listen to a book with a full cast. And for that book, I am going to listen to Sadie by Courtney Summers. I do have the regular physical book because that is my book club book for this month. I'm super excited about it. Um, but it's currently propping up my tripod, so I can't show it to you. But I am going to um, also buy the audiobook through Audible um, with one of my credits this month and um, listen to it because it does have a full cast. The third prompt for this readathon is to listen to a book that is outside of your comfort zone. And for me, that is nonfiction books in general. And so for that prompt, I will be listening to A Conspiracy of Fools. It is a true story based on the Enron crisis in the accounting world. And it is by Kurt Eichenwald. Prompt number four is to listen to a book with mixed media. Um, for this one, I will be listening to Sadie by Courtney Summers. Again, um, this prompt, this book has mixed media because it has a podcast in with it and it has a full cast, so knocking two birds out with one stone. The next prompt is to listen to one of your favorite books. Um, a lot of times listening to an old favorite that gives you a new perspective on the story and that will help bring you into the audiobook world. And I don't know what I'm gonna read for this one. So I'm not 100% sure what I'm going to listen to um, for this one, but I think I may try and listen to Peter Pan again. Um, Peter Pan is one of my favorite, favorite classics, and I just love the storytelling of it, and I always pick up something new when I listen to it or reread it, so I think I may go that route and listen to Peter Pan. The next prompt is to listen to a book that you have previously put down or DNF'd, um, this one is also a hard one for me because I don't typically DNF books, so I'm going to have to look and see what one I can probably pick up for that. Um, that one's going to be a challenge. It, it will depend on what's available, but I will try and put a little note down here at the bottom, and um, once I decide exactly what DNF'd book I'm going to listen to. I should have prepared a little bit better here. And the final prompt for this readathon is to listen to a book that is 15 or more hours long. And for me, that book is going to be um, Conspiracy of Fools, which is the Enron uh, saga, whatever you want to call it, uh, by Kirk Eichenwald. This book is 30 hours and 26 minutes long. That is insane. Uh, fortunately, I listen to books at one and a half to two times speed, so... That will cut that down a little bit, but it's a really long book. Um, and I'm sure it's going to be a lot of technical information about account the accounting world, um, which is fine because I'm an accountant, um, which is why this book is something I'm interested in in the first place. So that is it, my TBR for the audiobookathon. Please let me know in the comments below if you are going to be participating in this readathon. 
Also, let me know if you have a TBR video, what your TBR is going to be, um, so I can check out your TBRs as well. And um, let me know if you've read any of these books or if any of these books sound interesting to you that I have mentioned in my TBR. Um, as always, I do plan on vlogging this and we will be active over on Twitter for our Twitter account. You can follow Audio Bookathon and there will be um, not necessarily sprints, but we will be having some discussions. So um, I'm looking forward to that as well. I'm not exactly sure what times I will be hosting, but I'll let you know if it is me doing the hosting over there. So with all of that said, you guys know what to do at this point. Please give me a thumbs up. Be sure and hit subscribe if you're not already subscribed to my channel. And um, be sure and leave, leave me a comment down below, even if that is just an emoji or just to say hello. I would greatly appreciate that. That lets me interact with you down in the comments. And until next time, I will talk to you later. Bye.